Hey y'all, it is my 16th video journal slash journey and look, y'all like my silly little bun on top of my hair, on top of my head. Anyway, I went to Tai Chi today. I'm doing that about twice a week now and I'm enjoying it thoroughly. But uh, anyway, if I haven't already said, this is my 16th video journal slash journey and I was supposed to get on yesterday and tell y'all about the walk I took up the block. Like literally a block away. Not even an entire block away from my house. I was walking up the street to go to a barbershop. My son has these little cards he has to sell for football camp. And if he sells all 10 cards for $20 a piece, then he will get to go to two football camps for free over the summer. So, I'm all about free, so I'm helping them out where I can. And anyway, uh, they're coupon cards. So, if anyone's local here in Peoria to support the Peoria High Central Lions, I have coupon, dis coupon and discount cards along with a varsity football schedule. For sale, $20. Get at me. But anyway, I said I would get on and tell about my walk up the street and it has something to do with men being interesting that's what i said on facebook that i would uh make a video about men being interesting as i took this brief walk up the street so anyway there's this certain someone who has been claiming interest in me for quite some time since like last fall maybe I don't know. It's been, yeah, last fall, football season. And I have not been paying him any attention at all. I've not been taking him seriously at all. But I'm like, well, I guess maybe I could get to know him as a friend or whatever. Because he keep trying to claim he's trying to see me or whatever. So I'm like, he said, I'm going to be up at the barber shop. You should stop by. And I was like, well, I was already going up there anyway because I'm trying to make this money. And he was, like, trying to figure out what I was talking about. And I really was being elusive because, it, like, you don't have to know all about that. That's not important. <laughs> so, anyway, I'm walking up the street. I got two houses past my house. And this guy hollers out of his Cadillac. It's a long, kind of, like, cream yellow color Cadillac. And I'm thinking it's some other guy I knew. He kind of looked like I'm from a distance. And I didn't have, I had my shades on. I didn't have my glasses on. So I thought it's this dude I graduated high school with. Because he's known for driving long, usually yellow caddies. If you're from here, you probably know who I'm talking about. But anyway, so I stopped and he backs up. So I'm like thinking, oh, this must be him. Like, we knew each other. So I walk closer and I'm looking. And I'm like, are you such and such? Because I still couldn't see yet. And he was like, no, my name is blah, blah, blah. I was like, oh, do you know me or something? And he was like, well, I thought I did from a distance. But now that I see you up close, I don't think we've ever met. And I'm like, oh, okay. So anyway, trying to be smooth. Because I'm pretty sure he had no idea who I was. Even when he first spoke. So... Of course, he's, like, trying to talk to me or whatever. Like, let me get your number and blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, I'm not going for that. And he's like, well, let me give you mine. And I'm like, whatever. So I take the number I put in my phone. And uh, I'm trying to go, right? And he's like, let me take you out for a drink. I want to get to know you. And I'm like, nah, I'm good. And he's like, well, where are you heading? And I'm like, I'm going up the street to uh, this barbershop to get this money. And he's like, what you talking about? And he going on and on about how he owned these businesses and rental properties and blah, blah, blah. And um, how he dressed. I just go off work. I got to go change. You know, like, that was the reason I wasn't paying him no mind because of how he looked or whatever. Which had nothing to do with it. But anyhow, so I tell him I'm trying to go make this money. And he's trying to ask, like, what do I do and so and so and so forth. And what I'm doing to make the money. So I tell him about these cars I'm trying to sell. So, he gives me $20 and buys one of these cars, which is cool. 
And now he's like thinking I owe him something. And he's like, you let me take you to get a drink. Let me, you know, are you going to text me? Make you, I'm like, eh, whatever. I have not texted the man. <laughs> this has been two days ago. I have no intentions of texting the man. So I go to this barbershop because remember the other cat wants to see me. So I'm meeting at the barbershop just to say what's up. And so I'm like, I get to the barbershop and I'm trying to sell these cards to the barber and whoever's in the shop. Well, it just happened to be him and this other guy. So the other guy, I'm like, I know you about to get one of these cards because you already be at the football games anyway. He's like, yeah, but I got to buy one from blah, blah, blah. I'm like, dude, really? Anyway, he ended up buying one of the cards. And then he just gave it back to me. So I have one for myself, which was cool. But he wasn't about nothing. Like, I gave him this opportunity to prove himself to me that he should be somebody I want to get to know. And he was not successful at it because... I was like, well, I walked up here. I need to run up to Walmart to buy me some spray paint. You want to give me a ride real quick? And then he dipped off. And he was like, told the barber, I'll be right back. Well, apparently he had to go get some money because he had given me his money. Because he was unexpected, you know, unexpectedly giving me some money. And I didn't know all this. But he didn't communicate with me. So I'm sitting here at the barber shop thinking he about to come back and give me a ride to Walmart. So I sat for 10 minutes. I'm like, I'm about to go. And then he explained to me what's going on. I'm like, uh uh. So, communication is key. That's all I got to say. I shared a little silly story. I'm going on seven minutes. I got to get off of here. But anyway, some people were curious as to what I was talking about. Men are interesting. That's all I got to say. Sending out love, light, and healing energy as they pass it on. Until next time. Later, y'all.